All right, so what we're looking at are the skeletal and muscular system right here. And um, if we're looking at the skeletal system first, remember that these are cartilaginous organisms and therefore they don't ossify and uh, there's no bone in any of them. If we look up here, this is where the rostrum is or the rostrum cartilage, uh, rostrum referencing um, nose there in this region. Uh, then what we have is we move further back down here, we pass the brain, and we come to this region, which is our first dorsal fin, and this is where the fin cartilage is. You can see the little um, makeup of them right there, or those structures. We're going to move to the um, pectoral fin, and we can see a couple different things. We have one, the pectoral girdle, which is this right here. And then we have this next segment right here, and this segment is divided into three sections. And so the three sections, um, these three specific sections are going to be the um, basal cartilage. So we have the pectoral girdle, then we have the um, protergium, mesotergium, and the metatergium that make up the basal cartilage. This cartilage right here is the radial cartilage. So pectoral girdle, pectoral fin. Make sense? Fin cartilage, fin. The last cartilage down here is the pelvic cartilage and the pelvic girdle. So this is the pelvic girdle down here. You can see one here and you can see the other extension right here. So this is next to the pelvic fin. Uh, the muscles are divided up here. So remember that this is epi and this is um, hypo. So this is the epaxial muscles up top, and these are the hypaxial muscles that are on the bottom. Hypo means below and epi means above, and this is why these are more dorsally located. So these are the epi, and these are the hypo, um, or hypaxial and epaxial. Epaxial, hypaxial. The muscles are divided by a septum, the myoseptum. Remember, septum means division. So if you're looking here, you can actually see that. You can see the myotomes, which are the thick bands right here, and then the really thin one, which is the myoseptum. All right, this right here is the vertebral column. It has been completely removed. And as it's been completely removed, uh, nicely done, uh, you can see on the anterior region, uh, there are really tiny extensions off of it. These are the ribs. Now when we talk about the ribs of a um, shark, they're not like human ribs. They're, we're only talking about things that are a couple millimeters in um, length off of the actual um, vertebral column. So this whole thing is the vertebral column uh, that makes up the backbone of the shark. That's it.